Well, hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. It has been a long time since I did my last video. I was traveling. But if you know me, you know that I'm always looking for products that improve my experience while gaming or watching movies on my TV. Well, today we'll make our setup go from this to this. This is the Govi Immersion TV Kit. Make sure you watch the whole video to learn how to set it up, calibrate, and enjoy some amazing visuals when you game or watch movies next. Stay tuned. Make sure you hit the subscribe button so that I keep testing out these gadgets and keep bringing you new things. I ordered this package off of Amazon for about 90 Canadian dollars. But you can also do it directly from Govi's website. I must say that I was very impressed with how organized the packaging was. You're welcomed with a greeting message. And then everything inside, every single component is packed into its separate packaging with a bunch of user manuals that help you go through the entire process pretty neatly. Perhaps the most important component of this entire setup is the 1080p camera that it comes with. The camera detects the motion on your screen and then adjusts the color around your TV. We'll keep this aside for now and let's check out some other things that come in the packaging. You have some alcohol swabs to clean off the dust, a control box which takes the input from the camera and the lights. It also has a bunch of indicators and an adhesive tape at the back so you can stick it onto your TV. We also get these interesting orange stickies that you can put on your TV, which helps to calibrate your camera. We'll check it out later. And finally, the showpiece, our LED strip lights. They come packaged separately, wound around a coil, but inside there are two two feet long strips and two four feet long strips, which are designed to go around the back of your TV. I had a 55 inch TV and these were pretty long enough, so much so that I had to wound them around and fold them along the edges. Alright, now comes the fun part, sticking the LEDs and all the components on the back of your TV. We started off by testing the LED and then laying out a rough path. Once you've wiped off your TV, then start sticking the LEDs. At this stage, I would recommend taking some help. Looping the wire around the edges is tough, and so a second set of hands goes a long way. I myself struggled and was afraid that I might break the LEDs, so you have to be really careful when deciding what path to take. Once the LEDs are in position, you need to anchor the looped wire so that it doesn't protrude the TV and disturb your field of vision. Thankfully, this box comes with some anchors that you can stick onto the back of your TV. And trust me on this one, anchoring is not an easy job, so I will recommend using as many anchors as you can. This box comes with roughly 20 anchors for a reason, so use them all. Now stick the all important controller box to the back of your TV and plug in the LED wires to it. Remember to anchor. And now attaching the camera. This can be attached to either the bottom or the top. I went at the bottom because I didn't want it to be in my field of vision. Once the camera is stuck to your TV, you can plug in the wire into the controller box at the back. After all the hardware part is done, we move on to the software part and download the GoV app from the Play Store or the App Store. This app connects via Bluetooth to your system and then it may detect an upgrade. Let this download so that your firmware can upgrade to the latest and greatest tech. After the download has finished, we will go look around for the calibration option within the app. This can be accessed 
from the settings tabs at the top. Once you press the gear icon, you will get the option to calibrate and select where you place your camera. I went at the bottom and my position at the back was clockwise. You will notice that there are arrows available on your LED strip that can help you decide which direction did you install your strip in the first place. Your app will then display an image directly from your camera that can help you decide the boundaries of your TV. You can adjust these little markers to exactly fine tune where your TV boundary begins and ends. Once you're done, click submit and you're all set to go. Alright, I've been using it for the last couple of days now and my experience has been absolutely fantastic. I would give the Govi Immersion Kit 5 out of 5 pakoras just because it will change the way you watch TV. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, make sure you leave them in the comment section below and I'll try to get back to you. And in the meantime, make sure you check out some of the other videos on the channel and spread the love. Over and out.